Oh my god, Brian, this hamburger is f***ing good. Oh. How is it going, people? And welcome back to another video on Palmo Tribe. Today, we're having hamburger breakfast. In this hamburger breakfast, we will be needing these ingredients. And it is cringe. In this hamburger recipe, we will be using ground beef, bacon, black pepper, salt, curry spice ketchup, pickled onion, tomatoes, and lettuce as a base, of course. Let's get to it. So, we're gonna have each patty, 90 grams each, and we're gonna have a double burger, so two 90 grams patties. And now we're gonna start frying the bacon. So, we have the pan at maximum heat right now, and we're gonna take a cutting board out, bam, smash that there. Sharp as hell knife. Just open up this bad boy. All right, bacon frying. We're gonna turn the oven on for the bacon when it's done. Uh, so it just keeps the heat. So like any heat, just to like keep it hot when it's done. And now we're gonna weigh the beefs, put them on the side, and then we are going to um, to start cutting the lettuce and and the lettuce and other stuff. No profanity, boy. <laughs> I like to use a stick like this when I do my bacon, just because it's easier to to control. If I was doing a lot of bacon, I think probably I would use a spatula, but when I'm doing just one batch, uh, I think this is perfectly fine to do it this way. Or if you're using a larger pan, of course. Start with putting the plate on, start the scale, get the numbers in, there we go. So now it's at zero, so we want 90 gram patties. We have 59, 67, 76, 84, 89. Good enough. Make it into one bowl. Because these are gonna be smash, smash burgers. So then I'll just take this beef uh, and put it on the side. And it's gonna be uh, 80 plus 80 is 160, right? I think. So there we go, that's perfect. Smash that together. And there we go. There you have your two hamburger patties. Oh, wait. 80 plus 80, that's uh that's a little bit more, right? Because like this ball is like smaller. So it's 180 I think. Yeah, because we're making 90. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. So obviously it's gonna be more. There we go. Rip, rip mathematics skills, man. Voila! Voila, voila, voila! These are a little bit overcooked. And that's because it's really hard to do a lot of thing at the same time like angling the camera and stuff but it's bacon so bacon always gonna taste good so it doesn't matter all right here we get some lettuce for the base of the burger we got some bread over there that you can't see and now we're just gonna smash up a tomato quick just get a few 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 nice slices in there I like to have a lot of slices but yeah we'll do so, something like that we're not gonna use it all and now we have come to the smash burger part we have our patties we have a hot pan we need some oil and we need a pan that's all the way behind here and this is just to 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 murder those burgers and make them into real burgers. So, <clears throat> how we do it? Yes, I will show you. We put a little bit oil here, like that. 
so no sticky picky. Put the burger in and we smash it down. There we go. Next one in, smash it down. There we go. And you can smash it a bit harder because like they all shrink together. All right, while these are cooking on one side, we're going to put a little bit of zoom in, right, like that. And then some pepper, there we go. Some salt, there we go, awesome. As the burgers are frying still on one side, we're going to put some curry ketchup. So I like to do it just on this side and then I spread it out good. Uh, we have already so, other, so many other flavors and this is just plenty of enough for it. And then we put the lettuce like that and then the cucumber. I mean the, the tomato, sorry. <laughs> so I like to have something like that. So the beef will be perfect on top. So now it's time to flip these bad boys. They're really nice and juicy. And we put some cheese on top. Now we just cover it so the cheese melts a bit more. And the uh, burger is almost ready. All right, burger should be about ready now. Oh yeah. Now it's time to put the patties on. One patty on, put some bacon on, right there. And I'm just taking this with bare hands from the oven. Other patty. All right. Ooh, that is so hot. Why did I touch that? And now, the last ingredient and it's some pickled red onion and uh, not too much but not too little so that should be the perfect amount and there we have it ladies and gents it's a beautiful hamburger wow you see how that cheese is just dripping down and the tomatoes really fluffy on the outside and now we just put this on top and mmm oh yeah we put it in the mouth. So all right, here, here you have the hamburger. <laughs> it looks delicious. Mmm. That is so good. And the best part of it all, it was that it was so easy to make. And it has such good flavors. Even that tiny bit of curry that I put, it makes such a big difference on uh, on how the hamburger, how the flavoring is. With the pickled onion, it's just, it's just crazy, the flavors. Mm. All right, so if you want to make this hamburger recipe, now you know how to do it, super simple. And um, if you want to see another cooking video, one of my recipes, then subscribe and let me know what you want to see. Caviar f***ing kebab pizza. <laughs> Caviar f***ing kebab pizza, right there, you heard it. That's the one you want to see next. If you want to see it, then you press that like button and you comment so I know what to do. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Everybody have a great rest of the weekend. Stay safe, stay sexy. 
and uh, now I'm hungry. Bye. No.